reconcile Cause in my heart it's not worthwhile It's a bloody battlefield Where some go down, others heal In the end it's all the same All you can do is play the game
like the roots of a tree. Where should I go from here? I need a good advice. The elders waiting for me at sunrise. I'm in the prison, open doors, ten directions on the floor. I lose my mind, lose my sight. Tell me how I'm gonna win this fight. Just breathe, just breathe, just breathe. Just breathe, just breathe, just breathe. Just breathe. Oh, oh, oh. Take the courage, take babe. The courage, Everybody breaks. Oh, yeah. This is not your fate. Oh, yeah. Heaven you take. Cause I would rather die. I want to live it. I want to be who I want to be. You have a try. I'ma let you go I'm tired of the pain 
Good day everyone, <laughs> welcome to the new stream, how are you guys doing today? Uh, I'm just casually currently uh, on my way back to Urzea Majoris, 78 Urzea Majoris, while having a nice uh, encounter with the vulture. <laughs> That's so cute, that thing. And as you've already seen in title, we are continuing the grind towards the billion that we haven't finished yesterday. So, but we are going beyond the billion, to be honest. So. I'm now doing is I need to get the coordinates of my carrier so I can get there check its inventory do a little market update so for that we are going to use the elite dangerous market uh, connector which is uh, scanning for my current uh, system ship commander name and the station that I'm docked at just to update the data on uh, Inara and EDDB. And I completely messed that one up. I'm way too reliant on the flight assist, or in this case, super cruise assist. Okay, come here. Just a little bit more. And now we are going down. I'm using the plant as a little break here. And then I can actually uh, do other stuff as well. Um, what did you guys think of the new starting screen? Um, just today I was going over it's like, hmm. I could integrate the uh, slideshow into the starting screen a little bit more. So, um, tried out multiple things and settled down for a little um, a mask which I applied on it. So, we still have that animation of the starting screen. And then, in addition to that, having the slideshow recessed inside it. I thought it's. A nice idea. So I will be rolling with that, maybe modifying it a little bit later on. Um, today is actually a day where I should get my Twitch uh, check as well. Um, I've seen it has been in submission for a day now, so I guess it's going to be paid out today. And that means today on stream we are going to have the new sub badges if everything is going right. Let me actually see. I messed that one up. Yep, I did. I jumped out way too early. Who is? Oh. It's just a carrier that's being shown. How long would I actually take if I would be flying there normally? Half an hour? Would boost? About 17, 16 minutes? That's a ton of time. How about no? You're not going to attack me? But at least now I know that he is there. Thank you for visiting Acalia. We hope you find what you're looking for. 
Oh, dude, you just made the mistake of your life. Attacking me next to my carrier. You sure you want to do it? Had to. That's mine. Crime response team in C2. Okay. Good to know. We are updating everything. Transfer. There's nothing on the carrier at the moment for some reason. Sell to the market. Veteran died. Yeah. That's what we mostly need. Come soon by refinery, high tech and refinery. And this is consumed by refinery. So first things first, after we have done that, I'm just going to check in all right if everything updated correctly. Veteran died. There. Oh, I'm not the highest anymore. Let's see what's going on with the others, if those are open carriers or not. That's an open carrier. No notorious, okay. Docking access all. Docking access all. Actually, there's one that's uh, interesting. Demand 5,000, buying for 51. Those are pretty outstanding prices. Not for palladium, but for silver. So I might want to increase the uh, prices on my carrier a little bit. Mm. Okay, you chat message received event. Equal to. Go. 
Now we have a new command as well. That command is called uh, carrier. And that command actually enables you to uh, see the carrier directly and all the market updates that it's having. Okay, carrier management. I need to go a little bit higher when it comes to the commodity trading. Okay, let me check the prices. That is Galite, okay. I'm still doing profit with that. That's around the same area, okay. Funny enough, um, but yesterday I was the, I was only the only carrier that was buying those resources. After yesterday, a lot more carriers turned up that uh, was bu were buying those, and they are buying those in high quantities, like fifteen to sixteen thousand. And we're talking about a uh, total price per unit of 25k they're paying. Hello, Sandrinko, how you doing? So, 25k. Which is still not a problem. And by the way... Good morning, Rusty. Okay. Just bring those over. So you can actually see what I'm doing. Was waiting for that this morning. <laughs> so here you actually see what I'm doing. I'm going through the market, adjusting all the prices, so those are the carriers that popped up this morning with prices up to 25k per indict, which is still no problem. So when it comes to indict, we increase that a little bit and go higher. Same check for Patrondite, where they're going up to 31. Wow. Uh, let me see if that's actually still worth it. Yeah, still worth it. Oh. That is Petrondite. Yeah, that's Petrondite. Mm, Galite, I'm not the highest anymore. But for this as well, it's still worth it to go that high. Um. 20.4 okay screw that then okay let's update the market let's see there we go. Now the prices are adjusted. Maybe 
maybe I need to do the search again. Uh, not yet. Okay, but at least on the carrier page, everything has been updated. Wait, there are carriers without an owner? Wow. Um, temporarily out of stock due to this, the equipment availability is not guaranteed. Okay. Um, now I actually have to see where I can edit this carrier. My fleet. There we go. My fleet carrier. Edit. Everybody can. The fleet carrier's image. Rambino City. Actually, let me get a nice image of the carrier. Let's use the clipboard. Uh, open trade hub four. Let's see. Good morning, Gamecast. Oh, come on, T-Market. The black market is currently inactive. Okay. Market. Demand. I have no supply at the moment since nobody is selling till this point. Passengers. Oh, I can actually see who has their ship stored. <laughs> That's interesting information. Total, the carrier currently has uh, 29 ships stored and over 140 modules. 48, yeah, 49 of which are mine. Known travel history, yeah, I traveled a lot. Actually, let me check if that thing is uh, visible, even if you don't have access. Oh, it is. Well, you have all the informations. Commanders that just arrived are in the docks, may leave. Uh, Shortly, those are not listed as passengers. Okay, nice. I've done an oopsie. Wow. 
Wow. Okay. I will actually link this one here instead of linking um, the station carrier. Let's see, where is the right one here? Edit. I could do that. At the same time, I mean, we can do the numbers. There's a carrier cost calculator. Um, how much would it cost me? Uh, Colonia, you said. How far away are you? So that's just a theoretical cost. We're not talking about the actual cost. So, um, 22,000 light years. We have 500 light years of range. Yep. Strand people out there. <laughs> yeah, I know. But. Um, actually. Fleet carrier fuel. That would be 44,000 uh, tritium that I need. Which needs to be mined while we are going there because uh, the carrier can't hold that much. Mm, data, commodities. But if I would buy tritium. Mm. Where is it? Yeah, the way back would just be doubling the cost. Here, yeah, tritium. Um, current best exports. Best prices. 17 hours ago. G Clan, is that an open carrier? Yes, it's an open carrier. And it still has supply. Okay. So. 44,000 tritium times 2,500. That would be 130 million worth of tritium one way. <laughs> yep. That's a little bit. There's no place in Colonia to buy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the Nerada. Omicron Capricorn. Where's that system? See it down there. Omicron Capricorn. Class A star. Just out of curiosity. In a line spur. Ah, not that far away, but that would be a huge undertaking. Just uh, getting the carrier there in the first place. We are talking about a lot of time. I mean, um, getting carrier there is 44 jumps minimum with a 15 minute timer on each jump
Yep. So even if we divide it, it's like ten hours. Yeah. Uh, actually, forty-four jumps. That's eleven. Yeah, eleven hours. At minimum, eleven hours. And that's just the jump time. That doesn't include that we have to scout for resources. And then fill up the carrier and we need to fill it up good. We can't just uh, go to 1000 and here we go because there could be a region where we're jumping in. When there's no tri uh, tritium. So... As soon as we have a good location, we need to basically mine the shit out of it, fill up the carrier completely. And then start looking for tritium again, as soon as we are uh, getting close to the 1000 mark. Okay, do we want to start a boss battle? Yeah, why not? God. Okay. Let me just get my warrior. I don't know. Here? So everyone that gets in this... Uh, field gets a little 30% buff as well. Okay. How can I be of assistance? You can't. Okay, galaxy map. We are going to Aliyah. And our target will be... Um... Aiken Town first. Then we are going to Donaldson's. And uh, maybe check the other stations as well. Pick up as many missions as possible. And then we are looking for... Uh, actually filling them up so we need to find resources in this uh, close proximity Okay, first station. Actually, let's just use the first one that's here. Donaldson. What is that? What's running here? Okay, interesting.
I just need to clean up a little bit uh, Spotify while I'm on it. Since I have a lot of stuff here that I don't listen to anymore. What's going on with those? Oh, interesting. Great out songs. Hmm. First time I saw them. Doesn't take that long anymore. Let me guess, it's you again, Fury Bowers. Big haul like that, surprised you made it this far. I have an empty cargo hold. What do you mean? Ah, oh, shit. Submitting, submitting. Let's see what you have. I have an empty cargo bay, you numpty. See ya. Have fun with the police. I don't know why, but interesting that being in the blue zone is accelerating you beyond the point of being able to dock at the station. <sighs> Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I was not in the blue section. There we go. And there we go. We are docking at pad 24. There we go, that's pad 24. Right. Just a bit more, okay, perfect.
Let's see what we have here. Yep. I'm gladly donating money because that's the easiest way to get maximum stunning with you. Nope, there's nothing. Uh, I don't know if silver is actually worth it. Let me see. Press exports. Thirty six one three times nine eight seven. That's thirty million. Thirty million to get twenty million. And I have to do two jumps. Yeah. On the side for now. Gold could be worth it. Since it's just a small amount. No surface. Three minutes ago was the last update? Okay. We are definitely taking this mission. have to keep track of that stuff. Release notes, that's something that I don't need. Don't save. Don't save. So I just need to write down what I need and where to get it. Uh, not much gold, okay. Donate for a good cause. What if I don't want to? Hmm? Next station, I can town. And here we do the gym. It would be nice to have a tool which allows me to uh, say, like, I need to have those resources. I need to have that many of it. My cargo hold is that big. And that's where I need to bring them. And then uh, calculating you a route based off uh, 
availability. And then factory in the last time it has been updated in combination with um, its current supply. And I'm basically saying, yeah, the probability of you being able to fulfill that list of cargo over this uh, route is that high. Basically a route planner for hauling. Can you bring that much? Oh, okay, I off by one.
so Donaldson, Goffin Park, uh, okay, that's a type 10. That's a truck. Even more so than my ship. Just get me out of here. Oh, perfect. There's no. Oh, yeah, the top 10. That thing is the uh, heavy mass disruption. This time around, I do that while I'm preparing a little stretchy. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Anyone that wants to help me getting rid of those, you get free money. Would just be invited into the wing and uh, for keeping those buggers off my ass, uh, you would be getting uh, the mission shared. Mount. Okay. There we have that. Then the next one is uh, is station. Main system resource price. Okay, that is I can town. So yeah, I'm currently uh changing the game a little bit for myself to a numbers game or a spreadsheet game since it's a little bit easier for me. Bear Trondike. One five six. What are you looking at getting rid of? Uh, I'm trying to get rid of those uh, NPCs that are currently constantly on my ass. And the only way you can do that is by killing them. Since those are not mission bound. just uh, checked it um, this morning nope they're basically there because uh, I did a lot of missions and now they're staying there as long as uh, I'm not killing them or they are not getting killed
No, oh, perfect. 25. And for stuff like here, I would like to have the ability to get uh, larger wings. Since that would enable me to do those missions with uh, like four traders and uh, everyone having a little patrol as well. Okay. Which one is that one? Ah, oh, Donaldson as well. Nice. Shit. Um, one forty nine. Actually, to pay out here 50 million what the heck is going on i constantly hear the door banging again for some reason okay that's five million that's 50 million perfect that's no problem that is the small gold one, which is 4138. Mm -hmm. Indeed. She really likes it to slam doors. Okay. <clears throat> there we go. Okay, nothing there. Just got that one. Uh, not allied yet. It's osmium. Not doing those. There's our only massacre. Yeah, I, I'm usually the one that has to fix all this stuff. Bromelite. Bromelite might not be worth it. Since that is one of the resources that you're not getting on stations. Yeah, it's not worth it. Thirteen units, nice. Okay, and last station, Golden Gate. That didn't work out. It eh, happens. Okay, let's try again. And this time... Getting attacked again? The fuck? That's a pain in the ass. Just 
actually. Let's go to Ikutsk. And let's do the jump. So, this time, I am placing mine directly there. So, we have that area here supported. Everyone that's placing their units there is getting a 30% buff every 7 seconds. Okay, let's try it out again. Okay, there we have that. That is that. Minus that. Times that. That is that. So I'm basically just creating a spreadsheet at the moment for profit calculations and stuff like that. <sighs> There's actually a carrier that's selling gold for quite cheap quite far away uh, like having a total capacity of over a thousand uh, gold for 2300 fun part is that carrier is 20,000 light years away hmm? Come on. <laughs> yeah a day strip just to get some gold I heard that's totally worth it. I would like to have something in game where you can hire NPCs to protect you. Like having a bodyguard. I mean, currently that NPC is just annoying. That's it. The other one was way worse.
Good morning, Logan. How are you doing today? Hello, I'm doing well. <clears throat> I did a little bit of uh, work this morning before the stream. And edited a little bit the starting and the ending scenes. So, yeah. And the way it looks at the moment, I would say it's nice. So now I'm just doing a little bit of uh, trading again, just to get more money. And writing down the routes that I have to go. Uh, this station here seems to be empty as well. Acquire gold. Okay, next one is Golden Gate. And then we have checked all of them. She just completed it. Well. Okay. Yeah, they're doing updates today. Um, we are getting, uh, at least in Elite Dangerous, the Phase 3 for Odyssey Alpha, which includes um, organic scanning and the Artemis suit. Paul, um, I think those 1,000 gold would be better off if we uh, use them for the two missions that I have, because that's a 50 million and a 41 million. <laughs> I can actually fill up three missions with that amount. If I get a third mission, that one would be full. I think you already started it, Arca. funny that they are interdicting you even though you have complete empty cargo bay like you have a manifest scanner you can scan me you see there there's nothing and you can see that you can't destroy me as well I'm actually thinking or yeah thinking of the idea of just equipping this ship with weapons so they stop doing that Or if they do it, they just get uh, blasted into pieces.
Okay, now I know where they're coming from. So, the underlying reason why I'm currently getting uh, interdicted so often is essentially that um, I am aligned to a power play faction. So they basically are just interdicting me because. It's interesting to see what mechanics are responsible for stuff like that. Come on. That's something that's interesting as well. So, a ship scan always puts the ship into danger mode. Like that always triggers that alert that I've set up because that is um, basically triggering on danger as well and danger is the best state to trigger audible uh, notifications and stuff like that because it's the most reliable one at the same time you get way more alerts because uh, it triggers when you get fired at or fired upon when you get scanned and when you are overheating. So, I need to change how that thing works. Maybe doing it more specifically like an alert just for when I'm getting attacked. Donate water. I no have water. Beryllium. Source gold. There we go again. That is almost not worth it anymore. Since if I do that, say 900 units of gold with a payout of 50 million. Uh, let's just go through the numbers. That would give me a profit of 13 million, just for the gold. That's one of the reasons I'm not doing that. So, it's nice to have that. But I'm not doing uh, stuff like that. Just makes, for me, no sense at all. Since those 30 million, I can do other stuff with. Just got up to the 50 million mark. I like uh, to get a crate of Python. Do you think uh, what you think is the best? I mostly do mining and cargo, but I would like to do some combat as well. Then use the Python. That's the best multi role ship out of those and arguably the best mining ship in MPAD area cost a little bit more I think you're about uh, 
55 million when you are at the station that is not discounted. hyperlinks so the first thing we are doing is gold I need to check what's going on oops okay that I will be right back Okay, I'm back. Oh, I'm a little bit too high. Oh, that's better. Isn't power play fun? Really? 
yeah. When power play is the main reason that you're getting interdicted, it's getting uh, yeah, problematic. Had to read a lot and found out it's just me being pledged to a, a faction causes everyone else to interdict me. That's an annoying feature. But I'm only pledged for like four weeks and then I can unpledge again as soon as I got myself the merits to get the pack count. There we go.
And here we go. We have a battle in about a minute. Uh, so let me, let me get that thing ready. And it looks like Rambo is awake. Oh, Good morning, Jigimon. How are you doing? I can't sleep the last few weeks. Ah, okay. Might want to visit the, or have a doctor's visit if it's continuing to be like that. I'm fine. I'm sleeping like a baby. You know what? I, hmm? Maybe you're the one that needs the nappies and not Rambo. <laughs> Why that? You're sleeping like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> no one likes doctors. That looks a little bit better. Noggin him up with 23 kills and 8 assists, and uh, Sid is getting the Centurion Scroll. Nice.